Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to make this delicious dill pickle pot roast in the instant pot. Now I got this idea from my friend Kevin over at Man Kitchen Recipes where he did a dill pickle pot roast in his smoker and it looks so amazing. I had to give it a try. I don't have a smoker but I thought I'd try my instant pot. So here I am just taking some pieces of pot roast and it was two and a half pounds worth. I'm only making a half batch today, so when you make yours, you can get a five pound roast. Now I'm salt peppering it and just browning it like this. Now I just put it in my three quart electric pressure cooker. And now you're gonna need some unsalted butter, some ranch seasoning mix, and some French onion soup seasoning mix, along with some dill pickle juice. Now I put a quarter a cup of the butter and cubes inside, one tablespoon of the ranch, and one tablespoon of the dry onion soup mix, along with one cup of the dill pickle juice. Now this is sort of a play on the Mississippi pot roast that uses pepperoncinis. And now make sure your um, Instant Pot is on seal and not venting. And now I'm gonna put it on the stew feature and cook it for two hours. Okay, it's all done and it is so fall apart tender. You just stick a fork in it and it shreds really well. That's how you know it's really done. Now, the next step, here's just a little shot of it. And now pick out any little pieces of fat that you might see floating around. And now the next thing I'm going to do is take this out of the pot and just put it in a pan. Now I'm gonna turn my Instant Pot on saute and let the broth come to a boil. Now I have one and a half tablespoons of cornstarch and three tablespoons of wa cold water. And I'm just gonna mix that so that we can thicken our gravy. And just let that simmer for about a minute and it is going to thicken right up and it will look like this. Now if you want yours a little thicker, just add a little bit more cornstarch. Now I strained the gravy just to get out any little bits and then I'm just pouring it over top our roast and I am telling you this was so flavorful. It had that nice dill pickle taste but it wasn't overpowering. The ranch and the onion soup mix flavored just perfectly. It was super tender and I hope you guys are going to give this a try. Thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next video.